Hello, and here is a class on Time Machine. This is just a couple little tips or tricks, however you want to look at it, on using the application. So let's go into our usual Time Machine system preferences. System preferences, Time Machine, really familiar probably by now. Now what you can do is you can turn Time Machine off, like it is now, and you can actually manually back up. So it won't quite be as intrusive. Every hour sometimes can be a little too much to back up. Not that it's a bad thing, but when it's backing up, it has a tendency maybe to make your machine lag a little bit. Or if you're doing something, you just know it kicked on. And it's not horrible, but it's enough to be a slight distraction. You could keep it off, and then when you want to do a backup, you just go up top here, and go back up now and that will start the backup process for you so it might be a good idea if you had this off to back up you know every night before you go to bed you can go back up now and it will back up your whole computer for you at that point once a day is still pretty darn good now you do have to remember to do it but but it's not horrible another use for this too is if you have an external hard drive hooked up and you don't want to leave it on all the time you could shut off the drive and just manually back up. Now if you had Time Machine on and you shut off the drive, it's not going to stop it from backing up in the sense that when you turn it back on next time it will back up for you. But it will give you an exclamation point saying, you know, can't find a disk or something like that. So you, you would avoid that big yell at you. So that's one option for doing stuff. Another thing which I find handy is I get a lot of things I do not need to back up or when I'm shooting these movies sometimes I make copies and copies of these movies on different hard drives and so I don't need them all backed up I make a folder on my desktop so we're gonna go new folder and I'm gonna call it not backing up so I put anything that I do not need to back up in this folder now just having a folder called not backing up by itself won't stop it from backing up. We have to do another step. So we're going to go to Options in Time Machine. You know, it tells me here, do not back up. Now it's not backing up some of my other hard drives. I can drag this folder in, and from this point on, it will not back up this folder. Now, if you move stuff that's on your hard drive into this folder, it may have already backed it up on your hard drive. So you're not really you know, serving that purpose is kind of key that you save it here from the very beginning. Or if you are doing manual backups, put it in here, then back up so it doesn't back it up. But that's a couple little tips for using Time Machine. Thank you very much for watching.